Seasonal confusion in Butte, snow comes calling. Our John Amy is outside with a live report. John. Well, Donna, as you know, snow can come at any time here in Butte, and uh, it certainly came with a vengeance <laughs> this morning, although it doesn't look like it right now because most of it is melted away. But we got hit with about seven inches of snow. In fact, behind me, there's a bunch of downed tree limbs that are being piled up to be taken away. And this snow came wet and heavy and caused some disruption in town. Snow fell wet and heavy in Butte Monday, causing damage and some power outages. Uh, it's just crazy spring weather in Butte, Montana. We got trees down everywhere, power lines down everywhere. The accumulated snow was heavy enough to cause this large tree limb to fall on some parked vehicles on Alabama Street. We saw the snow had been too heavy and taken down quite a few limbs on the trees and as you can see, this, this limb here is out in the street. No major damage has been reported from the fallen power lines and tree limbs, but the mess will require plenty of cleanup throughout the day. We would called Public Works and they explained that uh, that's not their issue to solve, that the homeowner needs to take care of it, so I'm waiting on a crew of guys to come and clean it up. And here on Gladstone Avenue, a police officer is blocking off this part of the street to keep traffic from going through because the heavy snow caused a main power line to come down into the street. Everybody's out running around and doing the best we can to keep everybody safe in the community and closing these streets off so nobody gets injured. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News. Now because of because of all those downed uh, tree limbs due to the heavy snow, the city of Butte has set up these, these tree collection sites for all the down, they're, they're just temporary, but for the, they're all the tree limbs that have been knocked down due to the snow. This one is here at the corner of Platinum and Excelsior Avenue, and there's another site in the parking lot of the Butte Civic Center. Reporting live in Butte, John Amy, hey, back to you. All right, thank you very much, John.